what's up everybody this is Royce from Pedal Metal welcome to my channel tonight's video is just going to be a quick one um, I wanted to open up one of these Shuko 164 scale uh, Porsche 911 930 turbo this is a 3.0 and uh, just got it in the mail last week uh, Shuko has released they have this is called a European classics line and it's a pretty they're pretty impressive from what I've seen I did pre-slit this pack, so let's go ahead and uh, open it up. Here's the back of the other ones that they offer. Get my hand out of the way. The, um, if I can get it in the lens here. The Golf GTI, I'd like to get that one. And the 918 Spider looks pretty good. And the uh, street version, the Turbo. This is the has the Martini livery on this one. I just, I like a lot of the Martini racing stuff i collect a lot of martini racing stuff from back when i was a child uh this looks pretty much almost like the tamika or tamika or tommy however you want to pronounce it pretty decent looking like i said this has the flat wheel tail the first generation 3.0 It does have, I thought this was imprinted the sunroof, but it, it does have a, you can kind of, I can kind of feel the line there where the sunroof is. Let me get this in the shot. I think these look pretty, pretty darn nice for the money. I think I, I think I paid $8 for this and then like five or $6 shipping. Uh, it kind of stinks having to get a lot of things mailed to you, but where I live, we really can't, there's no hobby shops or anything around that sell uh, Shuko items, mini champs, auto art, that, those kind of higher end models. You really can't, I can't find in my area. Um, maybe secondhand at some places I'm sure I could find, but I haven't found anything. So I uh, unfortunately have to order, much like you guys, order this stuff online and review it. Uh, this will most likely go in my personal collection now. Uh, it's a kind of a shame I didn't have this the other month when I did my 911 or 930 turbo uh, video had all different makes and models this would have been cool my only complaint I don't know if I like the all over silver wheels I'm probably gonna paint those uh, the centers in I think in uh, black I the, the Fuchs wheels there I don't know they look kind of weird to me on the silver it looks kind of just blah looks kind of plain now this is a play on the target Floria winner I believe from 1973 I think that's what this is the number eight if I remember correctly so it's just kind of like this they never sold a car like this I mean you could get they they did have a martini stripe kit I believe back in the 70s for them you could get nothing like this uh, where it was a full-blown racing numbers or anything so this with the, has the day glow reddish orange hues to the bumpers that's also a play to to kind of look like the target floria winner i don't think you know, nothing opens up once purely i think this is all yeah this is all over static but for i think shuko's first outing um as far as i know this is their first shot at these the 164 scale i think that they're really nice from what i've seen i'd like to get the the golf gti next and i wanted to get that and review it along with this one but that just didn't pan out in time as chester barks in the background now this does have yeah this does have this has rubber tires on that's probably why it doesn't roll very well I actually, I actually thought I had hard black plastic tires on, but they are rubber. I don't think did I get it back on right. I probably did, but I think I'll definitely be ordering a couple more of these. I probably will get one. I think they sell it in red, black, and silver, without any kind of graphics. I think they're they look pretty nice. We have plenty of details like the. Uh, B pillars are painted in black. We have the, 
the oil cooler screen is painted in on the back there. You have the, the rubber lip on the whale tails painted in. The bellows on the ends of the bumpers, the, the five mile an hour crash bumpers, they're all painted in black. Really, really nice. I think it's hard to see there. It does say turbo on the back. I guess it was only the US cars that actually were, said Turbo Carrera on the back on the early ones. So I don't know, I like this one, really cool. You guys have to let me know what you think down below. As Chester freaks out, the squirrel's outside. All right, so thanks for checking it out. That's a 164 scale, Maiho exclusive Shuko European Classics, limited to 2400 edition. And it is all over metal with rubber tires, and we will spin it around as we exit. If you like this type of video, be sure to give me a thumbs up, like, share, all that good stuff. Uh, if you're not a member or a subscriber, should say, be sure to subscribe. It's free. You can't beat that. Uh, hit the bell for notifications. And until next time, I'll see you guys later. All right. Thanks. See you guys. Bye now.